if I can talk about it to make it easier on the people, the next people that it happens to, uh, then that's what I'm going to do. You know, even if it's just one person, you know, as long as I can make a difference with that one person, then I'm totally happy. Have you heard, has anyone told you anything that's really stuck with you about how you Yeah, I've, I, yes. Uh, I've actually gotten people that's called me and said, hey, you know, um, I've, especially after I've testified before the Senate, because that's, you know, the, the world watches that. So, you know, when they, I had a person call and say, you know, um, I just wanted to, they, and this, we're talking about a master sergeant in the Army, um, big six foot four guy, um, African American man, um, very much, I mean, just, he's a big, bulky guy, he was lift weights, so but he was sexually assaulted. But he didn't want to talk about it, but he said, you know what, I, because of you talking out like that, it made it so much easier for me now to go to counseling or, you know, to be like, yes, that happened to me. Because, again, it does not discriminate who you are. I mean, if it happens to you, but, um, I mean, there's so many people that have, you know, come to me about uh, things that I've said or when I testified and things like that, or even speeches and stuff like that, they'll contact me and be like, um, your story resonated with me and, you know, gives me hope to, you know, it does. Because I want, again, I want to make it easier for the next person, you know, to, uh, if, my, if my pain gives them some kind of um, some kind of courage to you know uh, to come forward and deal with their own type of pain and yes yeah, it's, it's it's so much worth it